Identification confirmed. And uh, I would play, if I were to play the game casually on my own, I would put it up to uh, veteran difficulty or, or the hi higher difficulties. But because it's a let's play, because Mass Effect's not really about the combat, it's about the story, it's about the interaction between the characters, I'm going to keep the difficulty uh, normal so I don't die too much and you guys aren't sitting watching me do the same parts over and over again. So we're going to keep it on normal just to keep the flow of the game. Uh, auto level up. I'm gonna only do it for squad. I'll, I'll distribute my own points, but the computer does a pretty good job of distributing squad points. Uh, target assist, normal, whatever. Squad use, yeah, they can use. They're good at using their own powers. So auto save and subtitles, definitely on. But that's done. Our character creation is done. Um, I'm pretty sure if I keep yelling Stalin down in the basement, my parents are going to get a little suspicious uh, suspicious about what I'm yelling about. Well, what about Shepard? Earthborn, but no record of his family. Because I had none. I was living Doesn't on the help. streets. He was raised on the streets. Learned to look out for himself. He got most of his unit. I popped me some bloods in my time. He gets the job done. No matter what the cause. What? Is that the kind of person we you want what? protecting the galaxy? It's the only one who that's can. That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. Oh, sweet. I called it. Maybe that's because I played it before. Call. In the year 2040, uh, sorry, in the year 2140, explorers on Mars discovered the remains of an ancient seafaring civilization. Decades that followed mysterious artifacts that re revealed startling new technologies, which enabled us to travel to the furthest stars. The basis for this incredible technology was a force controlled by the fabric of space and time. They called it the greatest discovery in his history. They called it Mass Effect. This is essentially the Mass Effect drives that let, uh, let us travel to all these different stars and all these different galaxies quickly. There are Terrace Prime relays in range. Initiating transmission sequence. Here we get our sequence. epic shot of Commander. Stalin Shepard. Sorry, Stalin Shepard walking towards the bridge. We are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. Acquiring approach vector. All stations secure for transit. There he is. Commander Shepard in all his glory. Approach run has begun. Those are the kind of mass effect drives, those are the relay gates that allow us to transport to uh, other areas of the galaxy quickly. Hitting the relay in three, two, one. one. Off blast! Wake up from your sleep. We have arrived into the future and the whole world is become. Boom. Check. Boom. Navigation. Check. Internal emission sync engaged. All systems online. Drift. Just don't really know what that means. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. I hate that. Yeah, guy. that bastard complimenting us and all. I gave you a compliment. So you oh. hate <laughs> You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So, that's so essentially, you do what Besides, all Spectres other pilots do, and you are like demanding the praise of the go Aaron, cosmos right? heaped up Apparently, upon you. The council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the yeah, official story. Yes, useless. That's enough. Your soldiers act like it. Sorry, Commander. Yeah, Stalin Shepard will cut, will crack some skulls if you piss them off. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Eden Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed I wonder what back. exactly uh, Pilot here. Joker is doing. He seems to be tapping the Tell same three keys over and over again. You get that, Commander? <laughs> Great. You pissed the Captain off, and now I'm going to pay for it. Don't blame me. 
The captain's always in a bad mood. He's probably mood. always in a bad only mood because Nihilus you, keeps though. complimenting him, that ass wipe. Uh, just... no, this is our ship. It's the, the Normandy. Uh, just gonna get used to the controls a little bit. Oh my god, there's a madman running around the deck shooting his pistol! Everybody stand around and act like nothing's happening and maybe get bored and ignore us. Uh, let's just go. Let's just go talk to Nihilus. And, uh. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. Will give us a chance to talk. What Nihilus is, is Nihilus, he's a, he's a Turian, and I'll get into a little bit about the, all the different alien races as time goes on, but they're quite an interesting looking race. What about? If you haven't seen, they kind of look like a cross between bugs Eden's and prime. lizards or something. I've heard it's quite beautiful. Yeah, we have shit. I'm a marine, not some tourist on vacation. It's more than just a tourist destination, isn't it, Shepard? Eden Prime is a symbol of your people. A perfect little world on the edges of your territory. Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? Safe enough, I guess. If you've got something to say, just say it. Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. Yeah. Okay. I already figured that out. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. I don't like being kept in the dark, Captain. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. So oh my god. I thought the Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. Their legacy still remains. The mass relays, the citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is big, Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the citadel for proper study. Okay, but... Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in council space. Well, before I continue, uh, Captain Anderson, the black guy, uh, can you guys tell me what voice actor he is? Because I know I've heard his voice somewhere, and I can't pinpoint it, so, so tell me who he is. We can handle this on our own. Unless something goes wrong. There's more, Shepard. Nihilus isn't just here for the beacon. He's also here to evaluate. What's going on, Captain? Oh, whoops. I pressed the, the wrong Alliance button. The has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. I was impressed when I studied the reports from Torfin. A grim business, but you got yep, the job done. I got my whole That's squad killed. I'm quite proud of that. Thank you. Spectres. I don't like people making decisions about my future. This isn't about you, Shepard. Humanity needs this. We're counting on you. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. Oh, joy. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Watch out, he Secure might keep complimenting me. Man, the then that, that'll just, that'll just tear it. Cat, sorry, Stalin! Shepard will really have to. He'll freak just out. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close he to He doesn't handle Captain, compliments we got a problem. Well. If What's you wrong, know Joker? What I mean. Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up She's on hitting the fan, guys. Get down! They show us so much, yet so little at the same time. No, he's dead. Poor red shirts. What I really like it if that, that giant hand ship were to like just grab the planet and crush Everything cuts it. out after that. No that would be pretty badass. Just goes dead. 
There's nothing. Reverse and hold the 38.5. Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. Really? I wouldn't have guessed. small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. So it was supposed to be a routine shakeup, wasn't it? But now all of a sudden there's giant Grab hand ships right to crush hold. the planet. Okay, so not going to crush the planet. I made that up. But still.